Hey folks, Greg Koch here. Uh, we are at Sweetwater. We're letting the good times roll. I have a glorious new Martin OM28E Retro, and it is outfitted with Fishman Electronics. Last uh, several years I've been doing a lot of stuff with Fishman, and recently been doing some stuff with Martin, which for me has been fantastic. I've always been a Martinsman. Uh, and one of the great things about this relationship is, is that for years I always used a Martin that I used in the studio that did not actually have a pickup in it. So when I discovered the glorious union of Fishman and Martin working together with cutting edge technology to make the greatest, shall we say, Martin only louder experience by using Fishman Electronics on board, my nostrils started to flare with a vehemence and parallel with great enthusiasm, which I think is important. And on this particular instrument, we have a uh, Aura VT Enhance system, which sounds very complicated, but I want to just instruct people on just how intuitive this stuff is to use, because I remember back in the day, I'd go see a buddy of mine who was playing, who was an acoustic specialist, my Willie Porter. If you haven't heard of him, he's an exceptional musician and acoustic guitarist, and his sound checks would last like three hours. I would watch and kind of hushed awe as he'd be sitting there using all these technical terms. Give me the 10K of this and this, that, and the next thing. He had this flux capacitor and a discombobulator, and three hours later, he had the most glorious acoustic sound. So to me, I was always under the impression that in order to get a truly great acoustic sound, you had to know science and math and have many hours of which to use for sound checks. And then I started messing around with this technology that uh, Martin has available through Fishman, and I realized all you gotta do is plug it in and mess around with a couple knobs and it's, it sounds pretty doggone good right from the get-go. So on board we have the under the saddle pickup but it's also mixed with this Aura technology and without getting into too much <laughs> aforementioned math and science, Aura is a technology that Fishman came up with which incorporates uh, how I like to refer to it, it's like mic emulation technology. So what they did in order to uh, get a sound of this particular instrument, this is a, a OM28, is they took a, a vintage 1934, actually triple O28, which is the same body size, uh, and they went into a studio uh, with di different microphones, Neumann microphones, all, various different old vintage microphones, and placed them uh, in various different locations with different you know, ceiling heights and so on and so forth. And they actually plugged in the guitar with the under the saddle pickup along with the microphones and they would just do this. And they would record those signals and that, um, basically that frequency range on board the special technology that Fishman has to be able to take a snapshot of, the, of that sound and basically have that mic emulation of that particular guitar reacting to that microphone and then be able to take that sound and put it in the guitar with a preamp that has an already matched uh, with a certain seasoning, if you will, with the actual bridge pick. I mean, what I mean by that is that the people from Martin and the people from Fishman got together and they said, okay, of all these different images we have of that particular guitar with all these different microphones, let's narrow it down to our favorites. And then once they narrowed it down to their favorites, they said, okay, well, how much actual image do we want to have in tandem with the actual pickup? So the Aura technology is already on when you engage the volume control. And there's a volume and a tone control on the upper bout, if you will, of the sound hole. Uh, but the tone control is actually, uh, it goes from at one extreme, it's just flat, the EQ is flat. And the other extreme, it adds highs and lows and scoops the mid. So let's hear that again. So here's the other extreme. the other extreme. So you just kind of do it to taste. I just kind of keep it on that side and just roll it back a little bit. Okay. I should mention that I'm going into this Fishman uh, Loudbox Mini and I have the EQ flat. So that's, I think that's a pretty good indicator of how a guitar sounds is to just have all the EQ at 12 o'clock so you can hear what it sounds like. Can you dig it? There is also an enhance feature on this particular instrument. And this is a technology that Fishman came up with, which is basically a transducer that's attached to the top of the guitar. 
And what that allows you to do is you can add, especially if you like to do more percussive things, you can turn it on. You can actually hear it, you know. So that's pretty cool. So if you're if you're somebody that is into that kind of style where you're doing all kinds of percussive stuff, you can let the good times roll. But I find that just having it on a little bit adds some air to the tone to just add a little bit more acoustic legitimacy, as they say, amplified acoustic uh, genuine tone, right? So here it is without it, without enhanced engage. Here's on just a little bit. Just so I have it on a little bit. So it just makes it very, very easy to plug in the guitar, go straight into a great amp like the Fishman Small Box Mini, keep the EQ flat, and you basically have all the controls at your fingers to really dial in a sound that is, as they like to say, as we like to say, a Martin only louder. So it's a very intuitive way to amplify your acoustic guitar to have a live sound that is truly a legitimate acoustic sound just loud so that you can rock with an ensemble. Can you dig it? Well, thanks so much for tuning in, folks. Greg Koch here at Sweetwater. For more information on all things Martin and Fishman, you can contact your Sweetwater sales engineer and they'll dial you right in. Thanks, cats. We'll see you later.